Hello everybody, welcome back to Dungeons and Degenerate Gamblers. Last time we won with the glitch deck, we unlocked the random deck. Roll the dice, start with 13 random cards. This can't possibly go badly, right? Let's, oh, let's just double down, you know? It's 13 random cards. Now, should we look or should we not? Negative Ace of Diamonds, not bad. Ace of Spades, or uh, throwing card rather. Interesting. Pi, not bad. 13 of clubs. Not good. <laughs> this is a minus one at the moment. It could become a minus 11. That's a fun one to have. That's a good one to have. Okay, I think we stop there. A zero is fine. A jack is okay. We haven't got advantage yet, so I can't play this. 8 is fine, 9 is fine, 9 is also fine, minus 11, and 6. Okay, so only like the 13 among all this is like a really big problem. And if we can get a drink, we can remove that pretty quickly. I'll take that queen, convert money into advantage for 15 chips. So... There's the whole deck. It's just this guy that is a problem, I think. That's real rough. If we can find our... Oh, well, that works too. I was about to say, if we can find our queen, we can send it over. But now there's no need. Good. Goodbye, negative 11. That's blackjack. That's also blackjack. I think we break limits. Absolutely. Pick your poison. Have a drink. How special. Remove 13 of clubs. And now we're just cruising, right? Now we're just like sitting pretty, nice and comfortable, chilling. We can make advantage any time that we want. So I will do that for the healing. That's good. We need four. We've got it. We are cruising. Jack and the Beanstalk is very good. Shopping. Ooh, memory card. What would we pick, though? Break limits, probably. Transit card, move any card from your draw pile to your foe's draw pile. Shame I got rid of that 13 already. Um, there's nothing I really want to send over that badly. I'll take this for the flexibility. And keep on cruising. Anything I want to increase or decrease? I could make these into 10s. Does that benefit me greatly? Uncertain, honestly. This 6 is just kind of hanging out awkwardly, isn't it? No, I'll leave. Hello, Squire. Easy game. I'll take an ace. Manager. Good. We'll stand there. I don't want to go bust needlessly. Right, they have stood on 16. This is an 11. If I send that over, this is just going to become a 1, so no need to do that. They've stood on 16 again. Choose break limits. Uh, 
they stole my memory card. And break limits still did its job, so I'm fine with that. <laughs> Credit card knife. It's kind of expensive. But it does get us out of a few sticky situations. On play lock on tie, deal six damage. On play lock, your you you play cards face down and deal three times damage. On heal, quick damage deal quick damage equal to the amount healed. We have a loyalty card that we could do twenty one damage with. Yeah, I don't mind that. That'll be an interesting way. Uh, we actually did basement last time, so we can go back up to the lounge. Fantastic. Send that on over. Puts them on one. We can... Take that back. Double this. Lovely. Instant Blackjack, if this is your only face card. It's not because of Jack and Queen, okay? I'll leave it. Don't need more stuff right now. Wizard, last time we had trouble here, but I think we'll be okay. Yep, so far so good. Six more. Lovely. Smashed it, mate. Give me a half. Um, teacher, because I don't want to get some terrible card from Three Card Monty. Well, we're halfway there. What is this doing? On heal, deal quick damage. That's a tie. Oh no, we round up, so that's fine. That credit card knife is coming in clutch, must be said. Key card. Do I like key card? Uncertain. I just know if it's not broke, don't fix it. As ever. Coin flip is always fun and interesting. We have to choose a card, so what do we choose? Uh I would not mind having three loyalty cards, but if we lose it, then the star becomes pretty worthless because we oh we do have other hearts, so could be. We could go for triple throwing card. That would do a lot of damage with these spades that we're making. Because this is spades, this is spades. Um, we could do the zero. Then we could just draw it and not have any problem with it going one way or the other way. Um, we have to pick something. We'll do the zero. All right, now we have treble zero. Lost and found. Stuff that we've seen before. Pass. Thief. We don't do the thief very often, do we? That's a problem. They stole my loyalty card. But we're okay.
bad time for that. On heal, deal quick damage. What happens if we exploit this now? Nothing. Shame. No, nope, well they can't damage us with it, so there's that. Five damage. We'd have to do it five times. Fifteen. It's just so much money. I think there'll be better chances to make use of this money. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Paparazza. Excuse my silence while my body contorts itself deciding if it's going to sneeze or not. Practically tricking me into sneezing into the microphone. They're going to stand on that, so I'll do this. That's fine. Good. Four more damage. Lovely. Flew through there, up to the bouncer. We just need to double the value of his stuff a bit and we'll be okay. That's a tie to start. Well, we can give him that. Then double the value of this. In which case, I will take that back. I think we are going to be okay. Hi. They've bust. Goody. Uh, a foil blank card seems great. There are foil jack of all trades and a foil trump card. Also incredible. Um. We now know the trump card trick. We could have memory card and make a bunch of trump cards. We don't... Oh, we do have one ace for wild stuff. Let's go with the trump card. It'll be fine. Popping up into VIP. Tie. So far, so smooth. Double that. Especially because it's not a heart. Got enough cards? Just barely. Right, if we could throw that ace back, I'd be very happy. Really, all we need to do is send that queen over and we win. I left him with two HP because I'm bad. But we're fine. Skip. Actress should be simple with 
our ability to manipulate so much stuff. on play foresight three is just free knowledge trade offer that for eight hp i think not collector uh, double the 11 that's going to be a real bad time for them zero half and ten is great because that's blackjack baby Honestly, Queen of Chess is just so good. It'd be interesting if there was a version of the game where when cards swap to and fro between players, when you leave that encounter, they are gone forever. Like if you gain, if you steal somebody's card, you've stolen it forever. You take that card to the next encounter or if they steal something from you. If business cards swap something, like that would be a good challenge mode or something, I think. Card removal. Um, I don't think I need to remove anything. Honestly, this six could go. I just don't like this six. Actor. Zero, zero, loyalty. We are rounding up, so that's nice. Right, that is offering us blackjack. They're going to go 9, 17, and stand, so that seems worthwhile. Or they'll bust, and that's even better. 32 damage. You can play this for free. Win. It doesn't burn. Another queen of chess? I could be so tempted. That's going to come over to us in a second, isn't it? No, they've stood on it. Of course they have. That one comes over to us. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. We take two. Choose a card to remember. They have stood. Steal one of those. We will. These are both worth 10. Let's send that back. Because that's the one that's worth 20. They've stood. Steal that. Lovely. I'll take another hall pass. Another tarot reading. The moon. Foe plays cards face down. You deal 3x damage. Exploit, unlock all, unlock all foes cards are face up this round. On play, lock. Foe plays cards face down, you deal three times damage. I think I'm okay with that. Head office. Right, they're at 20. Hi. Foe plays cards face down. You deal 3x damage. Can 
Can I halve their values? Don't need to. It's not going great. They're on blackjack, it seems, because it's dancing, but I don't know if that's how that works. Now they might be bust, which is interesting. Yep. Uh, I will take a foil AI-generated card, because that's just a nice thing to have. Take one, that's fine. Their max is 20, ours is 22. Loads of negatives. Choose a card to double its value. Bad time. Choose a card to double its value. I don't understand how that's working. Um, I'm going to play this. And I'm going to break their system. Send that over. Five more. Well, <laughs> send that over. Good. Skip. Overdue taxes or layoffs. Overdue taxes. Randomly remove three cards. I don't want to declare bankruptcy with bargaining chip. Half is fine. That's unpleasant. That's unpleasant. But hey, we had to make a decision. I should have done card printer and gotten a second spades card. They're at 18. They're still at 18. Lovely. You deal 3x damage. I'll take it. Bank card is nice to have. Shop. Trump card. Bounce card. Leave the rest. Card printer. I'll take the throwing knife. HR has less health. They're going to stand on 17. We need 9. Gets us some shield. Hit all three of those. Send that over. We could try and heal, but it would be excessive to our needs. <laughs> 66 damage. Don't need a second sweep the leg. I think it's this deck that has sweep the leg, isn't it? go with throwing knives. That seems like more fun, doesn't it? Well, steal that back. Ty? I could have sent the queen over, I guess. Good for us. Bad for them, which is even more good for us. Ten... 
They're going to take three. But I'm okay with this. Um, check that. That's a glitch card. I sh could have seen it before I clicked it. I'm going to take the foil business card to screw with these guys at an opportune moment, I hope. Possibly after they've already blackjacked or something. I'm going to stand on that. That heals us up to full, which I'm happy about. Solid. All right. That's great. They are bust on a 42. We are doing triple double... Uh, Triple damage. They have 56. We need 18 or something. Well, we can play this and stand, right? Yeah. Uh, I like this. It's a bit chaotic to the end things off with, but hey... Probably not doing this because I want my money for the end game. Deity of Hope. Did not need the health. Uh, let's go with a 10. Break limits. Good. They have stood. I think now seems like a great time to just do 21 damage. Probably not going to get that loyalty card to come all the way back around again. Uh, 10, 10, and 1. I don't need the 1, and they're not doing anything. So, that's fine. The moon is here. We know they're bust. They have 46 health, we're doing triple damage, so we play this and stand and win. Alright, random deck. Done. 27 minutes. Who said this game took a long time to win? I remember the first few runs, it was like an hour and 20 or something. But that is win, 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 win. We have not won with signature clubs, signature spades, or signature diamonds. But we're getting there. We're getting there. Then we can just start climbing the ranks on stuff. But for now, thank you so much for watching. If you're enjoying the series, please do consider subscribing. Hit that like button. If you have any questions, comments, recommendations, put them down below. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.